Hi everyone. Here's a little project you might like. It's an Easter basket made of a plastic bottle and plastic bags. Also we have a little doll inside which can be taken out and used and played with. The basket is like this. You can cover that if you like and put little um, the things in it for the little girls. Now, it closes in like a box, as you can see, like so. I'll turn it around. Now, we have this one here as well, which is lovely. And, um, if you like it. You can cut the legs off the doll if you want, if the doll is too big. But then we have the, whoops, the rabbit, which is two polystyrene balls, an egg shaped one and a round one. And likewise, I put a couple of bits in this. The Easter egg is made out of paper, paper mache and little bracelets inside. Little surprise, and as you see, they just fall in. Now, likewise, this same. Put it on, and we have these um, these other ones. Polystyrene doll for the head. Makeup is not great, but likewise, put a little surprise at the eggs inside. And um, so you can put what you like in. Little treats. And there you go. This here, the hair is um, a fleece blanket stretch. Which I'll show you how to do later on. So, hope you like them. And um, what we do is, anyway, take, I've already won, done all this already. So I cut it five inches from the bottom there and this is three and a half from the top. Now to do the top for the doll to fit in cut this off totally like this and the dolls you buy in the pound shop at the dollar shop and only a little over a euro or a dollar. And it fits in there. Like so. Right. And with this, it's a longer dress. But it's actually a skirt. Very simple to do. Now. So having cut it with a piece of material, just scraps would do, and I glued a little hem on the bottom, just a small, and put a run and stitch through the top. Now, I've done this already. You can put lace or ribbon down the bottom. But anyway, I'm going to put on this one. 
And when you have all the little creases sorted out, like this, with the leave an inch up the top for the waistband. And right here, I usually put the, the glue on the material first before you put. Let me see that. Put a little dab on it. And I find if you put it on the plastic, it distorts it. It oh, just makes it awkward for the lid. You don't need too much on. Yeah. That's the skate on. Now to do this, what we need is a smaller piece, which I've already done, and put the, the runner stitch through it. enough to go around. Really. I'm going to put the glue on this. It's quite simple and cheap. You can make any amount for the kids. Not put a proper seam on, just glue it. Yeah. 
And what you can do is put a piece of ribbon around here or some lace. Now we do the waistband now. So the glue on the fabric. It doesn't have to be perfect because it will turn out right. Now, let's get the scissors, just cut some off. Now, yeah, it's not bad. What I do now is put the glue on the inside. On the material. See where I made a mistake? Distorted it. And if you get a crease there, just put a piece of glue on it. Shame. It's 
very simple to make and the kids do like them because I've tried it. Usually show my grandkids and they um honest enough to tell me it's right or wrong. There we have it. Now, I think we'll put a bit of lace around it. Now with three plastic bags we make a plait for the handle. Now, after we finish that we cut these parts off. These are the handles of the bag. Three bags. And then cut two slits on each side of the basket and just slip it through. With a glue gun, put the glue on the end of the plate. Comes out. And press it against the plastic body. with this side. See, I don't want to make the slit too big, so that's why I kind of forced it through. Yeah. For some reason, it won't come out. against plastic the bottle. Now 
Let's tidy that up. Let's put some glue on it. And there you go. Same over this side. Piece of glue there. Yeah, voila. Make sure there's enough. There it is. Now, let's straighten this up, just pull it. Stretch it. Now, I also put a piece of ribbon around this. Right there. Now, Now what to do there now is this is a little rabbit from the top, as you can see here. It's the egg shaped polystyrene ball. And a round shape. Okay. What I do with the with the round shape, press it on the on your table. So it takes it, just gives it that piece of shape on it. Cut this one, the egg shape one, uh, in half. Right? Now. The glue on the round one. With the fat part of the egg, put this on. Just put it up the other way. Anyway, what you do then is, oops, hold that on. Now you get two ears of pink material, a little heart shaped thing, any kind of whatever you want to put on, and a pom pom. Do I have here somewhere? There we go. You can make these pom poms or some wall if you like. Anyway, put the glue on. On the back, a couple of googly eyes or beads for the eyes. I have beads in this bit of triangle, whatever. I just put some bobs for on it, and then get your hot glue gun. for a little while. And there you have it. Well, I hope you like them. I think they're pretty. As I say, little girl, give her a little surprise in there. She also has a doll to play with. There you go. Now, with the other bottle, what you can do after you cut it and all this, you can leave this on. Turn it on. Get your egg shaped um, polystyrene ball. Cut some of it off as much as you want. Here's your root and put a hole in it. Put it on that. And all it up. 
And there you have it. Make a little skirt, little dress, whatever. Skirt on top. Yeah. So now I hope you like it and if you do, please like, comment, subscribe. And thank you very much for watching. And happy Easter. And good luck for now. Bye.